Hello everybody, Yannick Chauvin here for Yannick's Photo School. And today we're going to be doing a video tutorial that was actually requested by many of my viewers after seeing the uh, Portrait Makeover Part 2 on whitening uh, teeth and eyes. Or was it Part 1? It's been a while now. <laughs> so um, they were actually wanting to push the eyes further and see how they could actually change the eye color in Photoshop. Uh, I finally got around to it. Thanks for your patience. Um, and I'll show you a quick way to do this. Now let's get right to it. The first thing we need to do is to duplicate our layer. You can do that by selecting Control J as the shortcut, like so. And the next thing we want to do is select our eyes. Now there are many ways you can do that. You can use the pen tool or whatever. I like to use a mask and you'll see why uh, after. Now let me zoom in here on the eye. Let me go to this icon here, which is the quick mask mode. I'm going to click on that. Automatically, the palettes here change to black and white. I want black as my foreground color. Choose my brush. Make sure it, it, uh, it has uh, some softness in it. And all we're going to do is paint the inside of the eye here where we actually want the color to change. And I'll go to the uh, second eye here and do the exact same thing. Like so. Perfect. Let's zoom back out. Ooh, we're looking pretty spooky. All right, now we're going to click that icon again. And as you can see, it created a selection. But the selection is actually everything but the eyes. We want to inverse that. We simply go up to our main menu, select, select, and then inverse. And now we only have our eyes selected, and we can paint inside those selections. Now let me just zoom in a little bit here. Perfect. Now the next thing we need to do is choose our eye color. I've already chosen a bit of a green here. So I'll just keep that color, but you can actually choose whichever color you want. Click OK and select your brush. And this is the important part here. If you just keep your brush uh, in normal mode, all you're doing is painting pure opacity over the selection. And it's not looking really, really good. So let me just undo this. What you need to do is select color mode. And which is second to last from the bottom of that menu. And that's it. Now let's paint over it and look at this. We can actually see the details through the, the, the painting background. And I'm painting the second eye. And what you can do if you want to see really if you got all the details of the eye, you can zoom in on one eye and then hit Control H, which will actually hide your selection. It won't, del it won't uh, deselect, it'll just hide it. And you, this is looking really good in terms of selection. Going up to the second eye, looking pretty good as well. So I wouldn't need to um, use my mask again. But if you do need to um, either remove or add um, some of that selection, just click on your mask again. And as you can see, the red appears. And then using either the black or white, black will add some masking, and white will remove some masking. In other words, using white will actually bring more green wherever you paint. And black will do the opposite. So getting out of that, since I did a f super good job first time, I don't need to mask again. Now zooming back out, Control H to hide my selection. And what I can do now is that the, the, the green doesn't look too natural. I can go to my layer, click on Opacity, and then reduce that opacity to bring it more to a natural looking green. So if you go before and after, let me zoom in for that before and after since uh, the resolution on the internet isn't that great. So before and after, before and after. And you can do that with any color you want. And that's the quick and easy way to change eye color in Photoshop. 
I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and stay tuned for more. Thank you. Bye-bye.